Well, we have what's surely going to be a thrilling game in store for you today. The hype has been building all week and the fans are pouring into the stadium. The anticipation is palpable. A warm welcome from Stamford Bridge. My name's Guy Mowbray and I'm joined by Sue Smith on the gantry. And we've got action from the Premier League here today. It's Chelsea versus Manchester City. Cheers, Guy. I think it's so important that both teams start on the front foot take the game to the opposition and an early goal would certainly settle any nerves this is the home side's team today yeah a 4-5-1 or a 4-2-3-1 a lot of coaches are adopting this nowadays as it does give you those two holding players while you've still got plenty of threat from the wide wingers This is the Manchester City starting 11. Edison is between the posts. Manuel Akanji starts alongside Ruben Diaz in central defence. Rodri plays alongside Bernardo Silva in the heart of midfield. And the main man in attack is Erling Haaland. We know how difficult it can be to stop Erling Haaland when he's on his top form. What are we expecting to see from him today, Sue? Well, because of his strengths in the air, I'm sure they're going to play to that. Get the ball out wide, make sure the deliveries are put into good areas. And he'll be brave, he'll get on the end of them. Defenders are going to have to stay tight to him, try not to give him any space in the box. Josko Gvardio. Alvarez. Grealish. Rodri. City pushing forward with options available. Manuel Akanji. Haaland. Guardiol. Untidy in possession there. Sterling. Now can he get the crossing? Safe but not cleared. And the keeper able to hold on to it at the second attempt. Well, you can sense the relief. It's a fantastic initial save, though. Raheem Sterling. Sterling. Gallagher. City come away with it. Happy birthday to Sasha Walker celebrating today from Grandad and Gran. Alvarez. On to Grealish. Grealish. Haaland. That's really well played. Halting the attack. Well, the effort never really looked like troubling the goalkeeper at all. Poor attempt in the end. Mudrik. Mark Kukurea. And it's been cut out. There's the turnover. Julian Alvarez. City being afforded too much space here. To take the lead. They've gone in front. A key moment in the match. Well, let's look at the replay again. The interplay between the two of them is so impressive to create the opportunity. And the movement is good to get on the end of it. And it's a simple finish in the end. Chelsea get the game restarted. They'll be disappointed to have conceded. That's nice vision to switch things. 
Raheem Sterling. Chelsea finding space on the flank. Gallagher. Good patient build-up, but not quite the end product. Julian Alvarez. Akanji. Not so much given away as cleverly won. This looks promising from Chelsea. That will be a free kick, and what a place for it to be awarded. Having a try, he can't break the barrier. Oh, well saved. That was a really good chance. And that's crossed the line. Goal kick. A chance to deliver into the box. And that's been seen as a foul. Free kick. And he's got behind him. And he'll have a go here. A decent try, not far away. Oh, that's really unlucky. It was close. And if they keep working hard to create chances, I'm sure he'll put the next one away. Diaz. Well, with half-time approaching, the bulk of the crowd won't be happy with how things stand. They've got work to do here. Well, there's not much in it for me, Guy. I think the manager will be happy to get them in at half-time, only down one, and just readjust a few things, maybe make some tweaks tactically, and then in the second half, really have a go. We'll have a go here. Saved and held on to as well. City have possession again. Advantage played, no free kick. Making good progress here. Trying his luck. Oh, that's brilliantly saved. Behind it goes for the corner. Well, if we just look at it again, I'm not sure we needed to, as it wasn't even close. But it's just proved it was the correct decision. Over it comes. It's only halfway clear. Oh, it's a penalty. And the spot kick is seen as sufficient punishment. No yellow card. Yeah, and I can understand the frustrations. He's lucky not to get a card there. This to level it up. Scores! The penalty efficiently put away. Well, we can see it here again, and he guesses the right way, gets across the goal well, but just can't quite get anything on the ball to keep it out. Really unlucky here. So it's one each as the game restarts. Raheem Sterling. 
Bernardo Silva. On to Grealish. Pushing forward now to make the right choice. It's out of play and that will be a goal kick. And the pass is incomplete. Nicely won. Ruben Diaz. Manuel Akanji. Julian Alvarez. Guardiol. Grealish. Bernardo Silva. Great defending. And that will do it for the first half here at Stamford Bridge. Raheem Sterling's performance thus far has certainly caught the eye. He'd get good marks. Well, it was a vital goal from him and at a crucial time too. It's just whether they can take that momentum into the second half now, because they have struggled at times. The ball is rolling and the second half is underway. Diaz Alvarez This is Walker Doku Diaz Jeremy Doku Rodri City trying to get things moving Walker Goku, coming in field now, but that's where any chance of anything developing disappears. Julian Alvarez. Using the space on the opposite flank. Alvarez. Bernardo Silva. Josko Guardio. Grealish. Haaland. Players waiting in the centre. Crucial defending. That's a corner. And the possibility for City to take the lead here. Maybe side against playing it in. Haaland. It's in! And it's their game to lose from here. Well, we can see it again, and he does well. He shows great strength and balance to fend the defender off, and then he slots it home. It's a really good goal, that. So off we go at 2-1 now. Erling Haaland. Mikhailo Mudrik. And that is a vital piece of defending. Good work to beat the challenge. Has the space to whip it in here. I don't know how he didn't score. Great defending. Mudrik. And they'll be able to get that away. Bernardo Silva. On to Grealish.
Jack Grealish. A little careless there as the ball changes hands. The ball is lost and the chance has gone too. Gallagher. They're not getting close enough here. Mark Kukurea. Delivered towards the back stick, but they're unable to take advantage. Short corner taken here. Chops inside now. And they've leveled it up. Nothing to split them once more. Here's the replay, and when you go through on goal, it's quite easy to blast it. He doesn't, he keeps his goal, just places it into the net. So level pegging as the game kicks off once more. John Stones. Manuel Akanji. Rodri. Walker. The ball back with Chelsea now. Haaland. He's in here. And that's a great bit of goalkeeping. That's what he's there for. Fantastic looking ball. And still the chance might come. Denied by some top quality defending. And the game stops with the award of a free kick. Good interception to take the ball. Stones onto Grealish. Foden. There could be a chance to win the game here. Foden waited beautifully and denied by a top draw tackle breaking at pace this could be dangerous and they take advantage and the defence ready for what was coming Jack Grealish. And that's a foul and a free kick. And the ball is still alive. Well, he scored, but it's not going to count. He finished it off nicely, didn't he? But he was comfortably offside. Mikhailo Mudrik struggling to keep the ball there well, they could get caught out on the break here they need to get bodies back looking for an angle here and there won't be any rebounds there
Now, if they score from this, they're off the crossbar. And that one goes out and away. Making good progress here. Coming in field now. And it's on now. Oh, can you believe it? With so little time left, surely that'll be the winner. Stunning scenes here. Well, if we watch this again, it's all about the run. We've got to question the defending, but I don't want to take anything away from his superb individual goal. So off we go, 3-2 the score now. There is the final whistle, and it's Chelsea who take the three points. Yeah, it was a close game, lots of energy from both sides. Quite evenly matched, weren't they? But I think they deserve the result overall. Well, it was a truly fantastic performance from Raheem Sterling. Nigh on unplayable. What impressed you most about it, Sue? Yeah, he played well, didn't he? His movement was excellent, and on the ball, he was a constant threat. Took his goals well, too.